Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. I am Michael Benitez. Today we're doing another ship video. And this one? This is on a true story. A true ghost ship. This is the ship known as the Arctic Ghost Ship. The SS Bay Gmo. Let's hear the story of this mysterious ship. Bay Gmo was... Uh, Bay was a Swedish cargo ship built to carry num uh, to carry numerous materials to and from the various ports. She was built in 1914. However, due to World War One, she would not seek service for uh, for a couple years of her for the first couple years of her life. But Beijima uh, was sent to service in 1921, and she would make nine successful vo voyages between trading posts and other places. The only incident that she ever had before her incident, I mean the accident, was a ran it was a, when she ran aground off pole in 1928. She was refloated and set sail the next day. However, the this is not the reason why the Beijima has become so famous in her life. She has become famous because she is the legendary Arctic ghost ship. On October first, nineteen thirty-eight, uh, Beiji Beijima was, was making was at the end of a trading run, car uh, carrying numerous, uh, carrying numerous, uh, carrying a uh, a load of fur. However, she struck ice, uh, and she was ice packed, which meant uh, which meant that sh a ship being ice packed pretty much means that she was stuck within a pack of ice. She then uh, so uh, the crew decided to leave the ship. The, uh, then the Be the Bejimo the uh, the Bejimo <laughs> broke away. However, s s 22 crew members were still aboard, and uh, they were able to save him just in time. The captain of the Bejimo believed that the Bejimo had sunk. However, a few days later, a le uh, a Inuit had told the captain that he th that he had seen the Bejimo afloat. Here is a picture of Beijimo after her abandonment in 1931. However, the story doesn't end here. Beijimo surprisingly didn't sink and, and was kept afloat for some reason, and she will be spotted over the next few decades. November 24th, ni 1931. Beijimo is still. Uh, Bejimo is spotted 45 miles from where she uh, from where she uh, she was abandoned, but still ice packed. She is spotted again several months later, but uh, 300 miles to the east. In March the following year, a um, a man named Leslie Melvin, oh, along with his dog sled team, spotted Bejimo floating peacefully off the sh uh, off the coast. Several months later. She was spotted again by prospectors. In August of 1932, she was spotted and boarded by 20 uh, by a 20 man Alaskan uh, trading team. However, they were unsuccessful in uh, in getting the ship ba uh, back in the port and abandoned the ship again. 1933, she is uh, uh, she was spotted and boarded by a team uh, by a um salvage team, but they were trapped on board Bay Gmo, uh, uh, for 10 days during a freak storm. The ship, the ship was then abandoned again. August 1933. The company learns that the Beijimo has been spotted again. However, she is, uh, she is too far out at sea to be salvaged. 1934. She is, bo she is boarded by, crew, by a crew of a schooner. However, she was then abandoned again. September 1935. Beijimo is, is spotted on the southwest coast. Uh, on the southwest coast of Alaska's coastline. 1939, she is spotted and boarded by a ca uh, by a captain wishing to salvage her. However, because of the ice, she was abandoned once again. This is the last recorded boarding of the Bay Gmo. After 1939, she was spotted numerous times during World War II, but somehow eluded capture. She was then spotted in the Beaufort Sea in 1962 by a group of Inuits. Finally, after 38 years of an abandonment, she was spotted again in 1969. However, she, if she was an ice pack, she could have not been recovered. This 
is the last known sighting of the SS Filipina. She has never been seen again. In 2006, a group to, a group tried to find the ship. However, to this day, she is still not have been found, either on the floor uh, uh, on the ocean floor, or still afloat. It could be a possibility. What do you guys think? Is she afloat or is she a sunk? What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below this video. She could still be afloat. However, it may be a possibility that she is on the ocean floor. We shall never know. She is probably still out there. Her deck's creaking after not being used in so long. And her rusted up hull looking out in the in the moon skylight looking for another crew. Beijimo is certainly a real ghost ship. <laughs> so long.